Is it time to buy or sell Ideonomic stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Ideonomics. Our initial report was published on our website on Thursday, April 20, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since March 30, 2023, our system has ranked Ideonomics as a strong sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 5.63. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock experienced a loss of minus 58.44%. This translates to an average loss of minus 3.90% per day since it was listed as strong sell candidate. The stock has broken the very wide and falling short-term trend down. Firstly a stronger fall rate is indicated, but false breaks and sell-off may occur. However, a further fall is realistic and any reactions back to the breaking point, $0.0486, are considered to be a second chance to get out. According to the fan theory $0.0048 will represent the new bottom line of the next trend, but it is far too early to say this for certain. The current three-month trend suggests a potential minus 58.13% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 56.73% and minus 17.74%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a minus 76.89% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 100% and 12.58%. This translates to a price range of $0 to $0.0529 after a year. Our latest daily update for Ideonomics includes the headline, High Volatility in Ideonomics Stock Price on Thursday which ended trading at $0.0470. The Ideonomic stock price fell by minus 20.34% on the last day, Thursday, April 20, 2023, from $0.0590 to $0.0470. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 36.07% from a day low at $0.0402 to a day high of $0.0547. The price has fallen in 8 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 50.53% for this period. Volume has increased on the last day by 21 million shares but on falling prices. This may be an early warning and the risk will be increased slightly over the next couple of days. In total, 111 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $5.23 million. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $0.89, cents, and the lowest price was $0.0402. Currently, the price is 94.72%, or $0.84, cents, below the 52-week high, and 99.33%, or $6.95, below the all-time high on December 20, 2017, when the price reached $7. Analysts have given Ideonomic stock a general neutral rating. They rate the P.E. ratio as buy and price to book as buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong sell rating. The following signals have been identified for Ideonomics. There are few to no technical positive signals at the moment. The Ideonomics stock holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $0.0658 and $0.103. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Thursday, March 16, 2023, and so far it has fallen minus 61.48%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Volume rose on falling prices yesterday. This may be an early warning and the stock should be followed more closely. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence sell signal. 
Pivots, sell signal 25 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal 11 days ago. Short-term moving average, sell signal 16 days ago. Long-term moving average, sell signal 53 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 50 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 16 days ago. The long-term moving average, buy signal 209 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Holds a sell signal. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Ideonomics There is no support from accumulated volume below today's level and given the right condition the stock may perform very badly in the next couple of days. This stock may move very much during the day, volatility, and with a very large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be very high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $0.0145 between high and low, or 36.07%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 29.08%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for ideonomics, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per share earnings. A negative PE ratio means the company has negative earnings or is losing money. Even established companies experience down periods, often due to factors beyond their control. However, consistently negative P-E ratios may signal insufficient profit and possible bankruptcy risks. In other news, the next earnings report for Q2 2023 is expected on SEP 07, 2023. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for ideonomics. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for ideonomics is at $0.0550. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. There's no significant support from accumulated volume below, which means the stock could potentially drop sharply under certain conditions. Proceed with caution and consider placing bets only if you're an experienced trader who knows how to navigate such situations. The combined average rating for ideonomics from multiple analyst sources is neutral. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On September 16, 2022, Johnston Stephen Eric conducted an insider sell of zero shares of common stock. On October 21, 2022, poor Alfred conducted an insider buy of 400,000 shares of common stock, $0.001 par value per share. On January 21, 2022, poor Alfred conducted an insider buy of 19,775 shares of common stock, $0.001 par value per share. On January 20, 2022, poor Alfred conducted an insider buy of 14,500 shares of common stock, $0.001 par value per share. On January 12, 2022, poor Alfred conducted an insider buy of 60,000 shares of common stock, $0.001 par value per share. Based on the 88 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 34.601. Overall, insiders purchased 31,122,003 shares and sold 630,153,584 shares in the last 88 trades. We have a negative evaluation for this stock and no stop loss has been set. Is Ideonomics stock a good buy? Ideonomics holds several negative signals and is within a very wide and falling trend, so we believe it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We therefore hold a negative evaluation of this stock. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a sell to a strong sell candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. 
For trading on Friday, April 21st, we expect Ideonomics to open up $0.0003 and start trading at $0.0473. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.